great win for us. Um, Oklahoma City has been playing great. Uh, they were like 9-1 and one in the last 10. And their pace is unbelievable with the talent that they have. And, uh, you know, we, we still gave up 19 points on the break, but uh, it's almost <laughs> a gift to just give up 19 and, and still have a chance to win the ball game. But uh, I thought Brooke was outstanding. He had a big presence in the paint. We posted him. He had a lot of shots at the rim, got to the foul line. Uh, that's the kind of uh, showing that I like to see from him going forward. You know, and be a be a threat in the post and uh, and dominate when they come and double team and kick it out. We got guys on this, on this team that can make shots, but when that happens, you just got to be sharing the ball and helping your teammates get looks. Um, down the stretch, you know, we wanted to go through uh, Brooke and Joe Hanlon a lot. Um, I thought that was the way to go. We've been talking about that over the last few games, trying to get them involved late in games, and I think that was a big difference for tonight uh, as well. Um, no, just a great win for us. Yeah, Tony, you guys lead wire to wire in this one, but there was many stretches throughout, whether it was third or the fourth, that they made runs at you. What stood out most about the way your guys were able to respond in those moments? Uh, in a lot of ways, defensively, I think we – we stayed at bay. Uh, it wasn't a lot of guys getting away from us uh, for shots. Um, they run a lot of pick and rolls in the middle of the floor with two guys involved to try to confuse you. Um, and, you know, guys like Durant get away from us or Abaka can get away for us from, for jump shots. And their big guys would roll down the middle of the lane for uh, uncontested scores. So we wanted to make a conscious effort of giving up jump shots versus a lot of penetration and uh, rolls to the paint. And uh, for the most part, I thought we did a pretty good job. And, uh, you know, they didn't shoot it as well as probably they normally do. But uh, I like to think that us not showing out as much as we've done in the past maybe has something to do with that. Uh, Tony, before the game, you talked about uh, moving the ball, sharing the ball, not having guys get too deep and then get themselves in trouble. Uh, just offhand looking at the assist to turnover ratio and how you play it, is this kind of an example of what you were talking about and what you would have preferred to see? Yeah, um, it was a great example. Uh, I thought our guys heed the message, uh, share the ball, move it, move your bodies, and the floor will open up for us. The options will present themselves and if we don't force it. And I thought for the most part our pace was great. Our two-point guards was pushing it up the floor. Uh, there was some uh, advantage uh, fast break situation that I thought we probably could have converted, but I just like the fact that we were probing and looking and the ball was moving up the floor. So I thought we had a lot of opportunities in the break and the secondary break. And then uh, whenever we didn't have anything like that, we were able to go to Brook and, uh, you know, get him touches around the basket. So I, I enjoyed seeing 116 points. I think that's, I can't bank on that every night, but, uh, but to see that, see that kind of pace is, uh, is rewarding.